Hello! This video demonstrates how to turn a low quality JPEG image into an icon. I have received the source image from one of the users of Rearworld Icon Editor and I'll use it to show you how to prepare the image for conversion. First, I'll delete the white background. I'll use the Erase with Fluid Fill tool and I'll play with the tolerance parameter until I'm happy. Next, I'll switch to the ordinary Fluid Fill tool to remove the artifacts from the blue shield. Hold down the, the control key and click on any blue pixel. This sets the current color to blue. Note that the cursor changes when the control key is down. Then click again and the artifacts in the vicinity of the clicked pixels are removed. Repeat until the blue shield is clear. Now switch to the brush tool. Set its radius to an appropriate value. This depends on the size of your image. And set the blur parameter to just 10%. Hold down the control key again and click a yellow pixel. The current color changes to yellow. Paint around the outlines of the lion to improve, the, improve them. You can easily pan the image by moving your mouse with the middle button or the mouse wheel pressed. The artifacts in the image were caused by the JPEG compression and possibly by a low quality photo used in the first place. Always try to get the best image possible before you start retouching it. This image is relatively small, hence I will not be able to make a Vista icon with 256 pixels. If I really wanted to have an icon in Vista format, I would need to upscale the image in the very first step. That will make the image very blurry but I'd be able to reduce the blurriness in this step. When needed, reduce the radius of the brush to be more accurate. Switch to the blue, blue color again using the control key when you're done with the yellow color. Use the brush to make the gaps larger. If you do not like a change you have made, simply use the undo function. The undo function can be invoked also by a simple mouse gesture. When you're happy, click the create icon button.
check the standard formats 16, 24, 32 and 48 pixels and click OK. Not bad. We could end here, but I'll show you one more trick to separate the lion from the shield. Close this window. Switch to the magic wand tool. Hold down the shift key and click on all the yellow parts to select them. You may need to change the tolerance or other settings of the magic wand tool. When all pieces are selected, run the drop shadow function from menu. This will add a shadow around the selection. Play with the parameters and when it looks OK, click OK. Now create an icon from the image again. Isn't this better? A little bit. These were some of the basic techniques to prepare a low quality image for, conver for conversion to icon. But there are of course more techniques. Thanks for watching.